Welcome to Crystal TV. Today we have Dr. Satyam Pandey, Senior Economist for the US Economy at S&P Global. Welcome to the show, Satyam. Happy to join. Let's talk about one of the issues which has been in the center stage for the last three, four years, which is the issue of protectionism. The advanced countries have always been advocates of free trade, liberalization, but now the winds seem to be blowing the other way around. Mm -hmm. And uh, we've seen, particularly in the case of US, uh, that it has moved out of TPP and is actively talking of dismantling the NAFTA. So how does uh, this reversal of, uh, of, uh, of, uh, of trade policies uh, influence the U.S. economy? It does. Uh, it, it is one of our you know, things to watch for 2018, especially the NAFTA trade deal, how the discussions will go. Uh, we just finished the fourth round. I think it's, um, if it were to be completely dismantled, uh, they would most likely case that the tariff rates would go back to WTO's most favored nations. And for the U.S., the rate is around 3.8% weighted average right now. So if you think about it, zero versus 3.8 tariff rates, not that much different. It probably won't have so much of an effect in the supply chains. But again, we don't really know how the policies will uh, be written, right? The new policies. Uh, again, in terms of just the pure ec economy or big economy like the US, I think we should be able to withstand some of the shock from this disruption. It may be more of a shock for Mexico, uh, which uh, would be, you know, which has, uh, you know, gained quite a bit with this, you know, NAFTA trade deal in over the years. The other issue, I think, which uh, which is of uh, rising concern is, a, is that the fruits of growth don't go to everyone in, a, in equal proportions. And there is, in, in, in other words, there is rising inequality. And we also have this tax plan come up, uh, which is going to put money in the hands of, uh, of people, hopefully. Yeah. And now, how does it impact the distribution of income? Good question. Uh, we often don't talk about the distribution. Uh, often we are talking about an average person, right? When you dig into the policy itself, at least the way it is formed, the tax reform, tax cut policy right now from the Senate, uh, it looks like most of the tax cuts are going, uh, at least more than 50% is going to the top, uh, you know, the top quintiles. Uh, the bottom 50% there, they are seeing some tax cuts, but um, not as much. And Think about it, these are the folks that normally tend to spend it, they have the marginal propensity to consume much higher. Uh, so, uh, you know, it, it's a little bit, uh, you know, we could have done better with it sort of scenario right now. Um, again, uh, for inequality in the U.S. has been a problem in the last 30, 35 years. And this tax reform, I, I don't see how this really solves that problem, the growing inequality. So it's, uh, this, this inequality issue is going to remain sticky for some time. Uh, with that, we come to an end of this episode. Thank you very much, Dr. Satyam Pandey. Thank you very much for watching Crystal TV.